Whenever and wherever soldiers train, the Combined Arm Center training is there to support the warfighter. Headquartered at Fort Leavenworth, Kansas, CAC-T develops training requirements, fields training systems, delivers leader training, and sustains training capabilities. It supports institutional and operational training to prepare soldiers and units to successfully execute unified land operations in complex, ambiguous environments. CACT secures funding to improve and maintain more than six million acres of training land and all range complexes around the world. It identifies the requirements for training aids, devices, simulators, and simulations to make sure soldiers get what they need. And then, CACT ensures that nearly one million training aids, devices, simulators, and simulations are at the right locations for successful training events. It assists 34 training mission complexes where active duty, reserve, and National Guard units prepare to meet the demands of the operational environment. The Army's most intense unit exercises take place at the combat training centers. CAC-T manages the modernization of the three maneuver CTCs, where 100,000 soldiers trained last year. CAC-T sustains training that touches all ranks. Each year, thousands of soldiers learn marksmanship on weapons qualification ranges. CAC-T also runs brigade, division, and core warfighter exercises that sharpen senior leaders' mission command skills. Last year, those warfighter exercises trained 57 headquarters staffs. When Army leaders have questions about training, CAC-T has the answers. The Army Training Network is the one-stop online solution for training resources. The Army Training Help Desk is ready 24-7 to answer questions. Learning how to train soldiers starts with doctrine. Recently, CAC-T authored the Army's Fundamental Doctrine for Unit Training Management. Field Manual 7.0 provides guidance at each step of the training process. The online field manual is just one example of how CAC-T uses technology to get training materials to soldiers when and where they need them. CAC-T approves mobile apps that deliver training resources to smartphones and computer tablets. Other efforts modernize Army classrooms by adding Wi-Fi capabilities. CAC-T's reach goes well beyond the Army. Each year, it provides training and joint air-ground operations to more than 4,000 soldiers, sailors, Marines, and airmen. CAC-T also promotes coordination with America's partner nations during multinational exercises. These are just some of the ways CAC-T supports training and developing agile adaptive leaders. Part of our job at CAC-T is to ensure that we can replicate the operational environment so that you can train. Currently, we are working to revolutionize Army training and improve readiness by creating the Synthetic Training Environment, or STE. STE will converge live, virtual, constructive, and gaming into one environment and allow units to prepare for multi-domain operations anywhere in the world. STE will enable the Army to train on the terrain we will fight on and will allow us to train with our joint and unified action partners for unified land operations. STE represents an exciting future for the Army training and shows CAC-T is always looking for new ways to support the warfighter. If you have any ideas about improving training, I want to hear from you. I am your user rep. You can email me your suggestions by visiting the CAC-T website.